track you weren't recruited more heavily by the Mountaineers? I mean, were you when you were in high school? How much <laughs> were you sort of pushing? Oh, uh, I gave it a thought to be honest. Um, Cause obviously my uncle played there, so growing up, like that's all I pretty much knew. Um, uh, Oklahoma was also, you know, one of my top schools growing up, though. Um, but you know, I went up there for a couple times for a camp, and you know, some things happened, and you know, it obviously didn't go the way that uh, you know my uncle may have wanted it to go, which is you know probably you know God's plan, and I ended up being here. So I'm happy that I'm here, and I'm, I feel like I'm supposed to be here. Who was your favorite pass rusher to watch growing up, and um, and overall your favorite player to watch? Uh, favorite pass rusher, man. I got a few, but I mean, uh, Vaughn is Vaughn is pretty amazing. Uh, I like Khalil Mack too, uh, but I feel like Vaughn is just more of like I feel I kind of see a lot of my a lot of my game as far as pass rush a little bit and Vaughn um, being able to just speed rush and use my speed and stuff like that. But um, my favorite overall player probably would be Ray Lewis. Um, just a leader and the, the way he can rally guys and the way that he plays the, the game uh, would, be, would be, you know, probably one of my, probably that's, that's my favorite player of all time. So I just watch him a lot. Um, I have quite a bit of uh, guys that I really like in the NFL. Is Vaughn is Bond, is Bond the guy you still throw on tape and study? Of? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah, most definitely, yeah. I study Vaughn, I study Khalil, because um, it's just, you know, I see those, being able to use that stuff in my game, being able to go out there and uh, you know be better in my game at that. So, one more thing, during the, the fumble return, pretty much sealed that game. Like, did you notice how quiet the stadium got as that play unfolded? I mean, is that something really that you noticed? Yeah, uh, <laughs> that, that place went dead silent. Uh, I mean, besides our fans cheering, but pretty much silent for the most part. So, um, that was. It was interesting and it was definitely fun because, you know, I had promised my uncle that I was going to call it there and win. And so uh, um, we made it happen. For as much as people have talked about the OU defense, do you point to a game like that and say, hey, we scored twice ourselves, you know, we, we're making plays too? Yeah, it's definitely good to see us make big plays and force turnovers and stuff like that. But um, going into this year, we got to do that more. We got to be more consistent with that. So. That's really what we're pushing for right now. You guys haven't lost a road game since you since you've been here. What is it? What is it about the mentality of this team that, that plays so well on the game? Uh, it's just something special about going to somebody else's house and taking 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 their food and, and, and going back home. Like it's just something special about it. To be honest, you know, that's that's just the type of team we are. That's the type of program we are. We love going in the hostile environments. We love going in other people's houses when your back is against the wall. There's nobody else, nobody else in there. And, you know, we just, we come out and we, and, and it's just us. And we come out with a win.